Tell Pharaoh that you want to set the people free. Command to him that they must go free. Do not compromise. Do not negotiate. There's no negotiation when you're doing the will of God. It's his way or the highway. It's either you're going up or you're going down. You're either saved or you're lost. You've got to get in this thing and walk in the faith. Because it's, if you just got this much faith, you can say to a mountain, be moved and cast into the sea. Moses, go in there. So I can see Moses as he begins to walk into Pharaoh's palace. As he walked up to him and began to say, Pharaoh, God says, let my people go. <laughs> Praise God. Oh, hallelujah. And we know that there was plagues that came. The water turned blood red. And there were uh, flies and frogs and lice. And darkness for three days. And the cattle was diseased. And there were hail and brimstone. And all different plagues came. And each time they came, God would harden the heart of Pharaoh. And he would say at first he was going to let him go. But then he would not do it. But God was doing And I, I, went and I wrote a book called Texas Blood Lake. The reason I did it is because the, the lake turned blood red in, a, in Texas. A, a lake in Texas turned blood red. And I asked God, I said, God, what is this? The Lord said to me, in the last days, read what's the days of the prophecy of the witnesses. They will have power in their day of their prophecy that the water will turn blood red and there will be droughts and shut the heavens. Just like the same anointing that was either on Moses or Elijah. Come on, somebody. He said, I'm going to send two witnesses and they're going to preach in the streets of Jerusalem. And it doesn't matter if the new world order or the beast, it don't matter if the animal Christ is sitting on his uh, throne. My God's in control. He is going to deliver his people. He is going to take the redeemed of God to glory. We've got the power in the name of Jesus. So I wrote the book and here's what I found out. I studied the, t the ten plagues of Egypt. When you take each plague and break it down, there was ten different gods that they worshipped in Egypt. They prayed to keep the river Nile for, for their food and substance. So God 